What's up YouTube, it's Josh Creates here with another video. In today's video, we have TikTok vents about being fired from your job. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Hi guys, I just got hey. let go from my job. I wasn't expecting that this morning. So I'll be fine. I worked for Midday Squares in marketing. They had to like let go of the marketing division, which is fine. It just like came as a bit of a shock. I'm a strong believer that everything happens for a reason. Able to maybe make more TikToks and create more content for you guys. Oh, I'm gonna miss it. I'm really gonna miss it. Everyone was amazing. And I've learned so much in the past like eight months. I'm still in the parking lot. I haven't moved because I actually don't know how I'm gonna drive home. But yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys and just like be really real. This is life. And you know, you gotta get up and keep grinding. If anyone's hiring and marketing, anyone knows anyone that's hiring a marketing specialist, um, I'm free. Oh onwards and upwards from here okay bye uh, sometimes you have to cry to feel refreshed robert we wanted to let you know that uh today is going to be your last day of employment um so with dining craft we are terminating due to a pattern of not following safety policies are you recording i am it is against Petra policy to record oh it is mm. okay on 7-21-2022, a third written warning uh, for cell phone usage on rolling stock. Oh, why would he do that? Is that a blunt in his ear? On the side of his face? No, that's a pen. No, oh my god. Touch me, I... And this is just ignorance, Loki. Fuck y'all looking scared now for? Huh? Fuck you looking scared now for? Robert, I need you to I step out. That was kind of ignorant. You don't have to do that. So does it mean that I shut this computer off and be done? Like, or am I fucking expected to answer more emails after this? Hi. Thanks for jumping on. No um, so I'm actually here to inform you that today is your last day at Cali um we've determined that this is no longer a critical role for the company um and are eliminating the position and we very much appreciate all the work that you've done during your time here your account will be shut down during the meeting and you will no longer have access to any own systems um we do have some offboarding logistics to go over with you and so i'm going to actually drop from the call now and hand it over to danny from hr so uh, we'll answer everything but you know the, the questions that you may have after the meeting um, is there anything that I can answer for you at the moment? I, I honestly do not know. This is not planned or expected. So I honestly Understand. am very off base. So no, um, yeah. if once you send me the package, will that be the email to answer and like to ask any questions on? Yes. And, and take your time. I know this is, I know this is a lot. And, um... I, it sucks. Not going to lie. Like, Really f***ing sucks because I talked to you yesterday, so real f I know oh, you man. you don't hold any of the blame. Real f***ing. Take your time and review the information that we sent over to you, and um, we'll be happy to help in any way we can. Okay, so does it mean that I shut this computer off and be done? Like, or am I expected to answer more emails after this like you have no more expectations great love that for me thank you so much you're free now you are free sad that she was crying i though. bought this for a job that fired me the day it got delivered yeah you heard me right they fired me so i bought this desk chair because i started a work from home job with united healthcare and i was fired 30 minutes before this chair came but regardless i needed a new desk chair because i was working with a rocking chair and i'm actually really excited to use this chair so i'm sure you're probably wondering why did you get fired i was hired as a contract for pharmacy work so my recruiter contacted me and told me that they were firing me because i was leaving the the meeting too frequently so mind you i was sick and i let the trainer know that i'm not feeling good I have a lot of mucus and I'm going to turn my camera off 
to blow my nose and cough up the mute so people right. don't have to see that so i'm kind of confused and you can hear it in her voice too and why i'm getting fired for this but okay i'm not even stressed out about it because i really miss being a stay-at-home mom and just focusing on my content creation and my businesses working for somebody is just really not for me i only got this job so that i can buy myself a car and i'm sure i'll still get it regardless i really like this chair and i'm glad i got it i got it like 50 percent off from walmart i also started vlogmas on youtube go subscribe and watch my videos because i just got fired <laughs> Wow. If you've been terminated, how do you mm. best handle it? Oh, that's a good one. Be honest. Because mm. we always ask people, if I could speak to your boss, what areas of improvement would they tell me you had? And my favorite ones are the ones that were like, oh, no, I, I, there wasn't any. I, I did my job perfectly. And I'm just like, Charles will re-ask the question two or three times in different manners to try to give them the opportunity to, I wasn't perfect. Here's areas I could improve. We've literally had people that are like, no, nothing at all. And I'm like, please look, can we end this interview now? So I think if I got terminated, I would say, you know what? There were some expectations. I feel like these were the ones that I wasn't meeting. And those were ones that for whatever reason it was, it's not my strength. And I didn't realize that those would be expected of me. And so it just didn't work. But in this job that I'm applying with you, I know that the things that you're looking for from what you posted, those are my eights, nines, and tens. And I know that I can crush at those things. Mm, that's a good way to put it eight nines and tens so i just got fired from my job um i am really pissed off about it to be honest with you and i'm not making this video for like sympathy or to like cry on camera to the whole world um i've already cried enough today but i am really actually emotional about it because you know i I wasn't the happiest in my job you know I, I feel like I kind of in a way manifested this some in some weird way but um, I still was given zero notice zero times to plan zero to, I have no idea what's next I have no idea what's next and that is 100% legal in the state of Florida they can do that um, the irony in all of this is that I myself am a recruiter so um, yeah, I, I already know how this goes, right? Um, I am pissed off that employers preach, you know, wanting employees that have tenure, wanting employees that um, are looking for their next home, wanting employees who are willing to stay and work hard and want to do overtime and all this fucking bullshit. Um, and then they tell us, hey it's always professionals put your two weeks notice in so that you have you know you leave with in good standing you can get a good reference like it's all a scam bing 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 because as soon as you don't serve your employer anymore as soon as you don't meet the bottom line they will let you go in a heartbeat you're replaceable you're 100 percent replaceable no yet they want position. you to act like your job is the end all be all of your whole entire fucking life you spend more hours in an office than you do at home with your family. The whole system is a scam. Trading your time for money is a scam. And I feel like this is a really big sign from the universe for me right now. But like immediately, I'm just pissed off that I'm 27 years old. I spent a lot of time working on my professional career, trying to put myself out there, trying to make money, trying to make a name for myself, trying to f break cycles and generations of trauma and coming from a family that is not educated, doesn't have careers, like, it's all a scam. It's all a scam because the second that you don't serve them a purpose anymore, they will let you go. You're replaceable. And I don't even know what's next for me. I don't even know what's next for me. But yeah, that's it. I was fired for no reason. Exactly. That's the main reason they got fired for no reason. <laughs> it's crazy, man. My raggedy ass just got fired from Walmart. What? They tell me I got like 22 points. I've exceeded some type of policy. I knew you were shit. <laughs> huh? I knew you were doing nothing. You were coming to work late. You were leaving early. 
You calling that? Let me clock out. It should not be this damn funny. The fact that I'm legitly having a blast right now. Oh, thank you. But y'all, I literally just got fired. And I look good. I knew that was the reason why I did my makeup today. I did my makeup to come get fired at Walmart today, boo. So y'all do that, baby. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You guys could if tell. If you just got fired from your job, here's three things that you need to do right now. Number one, immediately go file for unemployment, also known as EDD. If you're gangster enough, you should definitely go and check out disability. You'll get more money. Number two, if you have some money, definitely start traveling. You're never going to get another chance. You're going to be working the rest of your life. Might as well spend your time off exploring the world if you're in between jobs tell your next job you need another two or three weeks to get some personal things together and use that time to go travel and number three now that you have some spare time go start some fucking hobbies go start that boxing class learn some new skills start Fast. a side business whatever yep. it is just go do it keep your brain working when i got laid off i started two side hustles and they're still making me money till this day so Go ahead and go try it. Remember, just get out of your fucking bed. Doing anything is better than laying in bed, just scrolling for hours on end. Wow, that was motivational. I can't lie, that was motivational. Shout out to him, man. Well, they just find me, so. No There's a whole fucking pot in this record. What the fuck? Hey. Hey, you might as well just take everything. You worked hard, changed the garbage so many times, manage more than the managers. Uh, actually, let me keep this present. Can you help me? Yeah. Nah, they definitely got fired for that. But anyways, guys, that is it for this video. As you can see, a lot of people were. Well, not really a lot of people were emotional about getting fired. Maybe like the first girl was the more emotional one. The rest were just like, forget this. Like they're happy it happened. They're glad it happened. And which they should be and which any of us should be. Because we are not supposed to be working in the first place, man. We're not. But anyways, guys. Let me hear your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me hear it, man. Let me hear what type of videos you guys would want. I'm an open book. Let me hear it. Let me see it. Let me hear it. All the above. But anyways, guys, uh, needless to say, everything will be okay. My name is Josh Creates. I am out.